Do you think she'll remember anything? I hope not. What was that? Max! It's going to be more difficult to do this once school begins. i figure out where this came from and why there was a second one. I shouldn't be travelling in packs. We promised Aunt Penny we'd go, Max. School will just be an obstacle for me. I'm sure it'll be fine. I don't really have much of a choice.
Hello Nova Stream, my name is Mark Halliday and in anticipation for the new Guardians of the Galaxy movie I will be joined by the lovely Ellie Stewart as a look back to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Today we're going to be looking back at Iron Man which came out in 2008 and was directed by John Favreau. It grossed $585 million worldwide. Wow, half a billion in 2008. Because very famously they sold off all their properties early on. Yeah, with Fantastic Four and X-Men being to Fox and Spider-Man being to Sony. And so they were only left with these littler characters, I guess you call them. More unknown. Once mankind accepted a simple truth that they were not alone in this universe. Some worlds man believed to be home to their gods. Others they knew to fear. Legend tells us one thing, history another. But every now and then we find something that belongs to both. Mark Halliday and Ellie Stewart back for Nova Stream, taking a look at the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Today we have ventured out of Midgard and to Asgard, taking a look at Thor. All the answers you seek will be yours once I reclaim your name. Mia Mia? What's Mia Mia? I love that name. I love in the second one when they're all shouting out each other's names and Kat Denning, she turns and she goes, Mia Mia! And it, it gives a real kind of flashback to the Rocky Horror Picture Show where it's the Dr. Scott, Janet, Brad, Rocky dramatic head turns. So here we are. A thief, two thugs, an assassin, and a maniac. But we're not going to stand by as evil wipes out the galaxy. I get Hello, Nova Stream. It is Mark Halliday and Ellie Stewart back again for Marvel A Day. It is our final Marvel Cinematic Universe podcast as we have reviewed every movie that ever was. Uh, we're ending today with Guardians of the Galaxy, but we will be back in a week or two with Spider Man. This movie was directed by James Gunn and it was actually just released last week in America. Um, it grows 65 million in America opening weekend. I come from Earth, a planet of outlaws. My name is Peter Quill. There's one other name you might know me by. Star-Lord. Who? Well, Star-Lord, man. Legendary outlaw. Chris Pratt plays the anti-hero of the film known as Peter Quill or Star-Lord. Many people know him from Parks and Recreation and he actually had a massive transformation by...